Okay, this is Big Baby J with another episode of Final Fantasy XII, the Zodiac Age. At this point in the game, I'm working on my burning bow. Alright. What I've done so far, I've got my chain leveled to the highest level. And, uh, I'm going to show you my config. You want your battle speed to be slow. So, slow as possible. Reason why you want this because you're going to be using Knights of Rust. That's, that's what we're going to be using to take out the uh, dive talent. So, not to us are instant. So, once you use them, well, the demonstration is in order. So, let's go ahead and get started. Alright, now that I've shot my uh, not a rust. We're gonna go ahead and uh, get it equipped again and throw another knot Now we're gonna unequip now. Reason why I'm doing this, it cancels your uh, actions and you're able to move faster, attack faster actually. That's how you're gonna get your burning bow. Right now, I still have yet to receive it. So, we're gonna keep grinding. Got my diamond armor equipped. And if you know where you are right now, that's the entrance to Zatarin Caverns. This area right here, if you go here, you can collect your diamond armor. That's where I get mine from. So, that's how we do it. You got to have your diamond armor equipped to get the burning bow. Or not get them out of rest for the burn up. Again, equip. Cast another one. And unequip. Cast another one. That's not working out like I want, but. It'll get the job done and eventually. Not to rush, what it does is it's a variant. You don't know what kind of attack you're gonna get. You can get a high attack or a low attack, as you've been seeing. And as you see that uh, my HP is high. The higher your HP, the more not a rust would do. But it's not guaranteed the exact percentage. So it can be more or less, sort of like a bow breaker. make sure you don't run out of knots of rust always uh i cleared this area out right here and i just run around trying to collect more knots of rust just in case i uh keep my supply up you need to keep your supply up at all times I tried the uh, the other way of getting it. That takes too long, or I'm just impatient. You can uh, load, reset, load, reset after you uh, while you uh, trying to kill a die talent. Uh, that's taking too long. So um, I decided to go ahead and just chain them and do it this way. So now we're just gonna go back to the next screen because uh, we need to go two screens back. And while I'm in this screen, these weak enemies are weak, so I can take a few hits and grind a few uh, not to rust from this area as well. I try to stay within the 40 range. Like I said, the, the damage output is not that high at some times. Sometimes you can take them out with two knots of rust. But make sure you have enough because there's three dive talents in that area. You want to go ahead and uh, get as many as you can. My matter of fact, I can heal myself. I forgot about that. Yeah, Vanilla can heal herself.
Now in this area, there is a rare mob called the Vitalin. He can give you a problem, but if you got a Phoenix down, he won't be a problem at all. He's undead. So if he's in the area, uh, get rid of him as soon as possible. That way you can go ahead and just go through this area. No enemies. As you see, I killed every enemy in that area. So now I just need to run over here and get back to my dive talents. Okay, finally got it. Finally got my burning bow. It took a while, but I finally got it. And it finally, I got what I need. Okay, now let's equip that baby. The Pinello. 77 attack, outstanding. Let's get your broad sword back. Okay. Finally got it. Let's put it to some use. Let's kill this guy. Alright, there we go. Now I can put my big back up. Fast again. And that'll do it for this episode. I'll catch you guys next time.